<laughs> Meat bicycle. Hello everybody, welcome back to another modded guide here on Borderlands 2. Today we are back with a uh, different mod, uh, this is a game mod, um, so it's a bit same process as the modded weapon guides as always, but uh, this one will actually change uh, a certain thing in the game. And uh, this is improved Butt Stallion, um, which is uh, better drops from Butt Stallion uh, and her ass and her mouth. Uh, so Butt Stallion obviously is uh, here in Flame Rock Refuge, you uh, get to unlock her um, when you're uh, actually playing through the uh, Tiny Tina DLC. Uh, but at endgame, basically you walk up to her and uh, give her some uh, iridium and she will pop certain things out of uh, each end of her. Uh, and these things are absolutely rubbish half the time, you get things like health and a bit of money and stuff. And you'll get the old weapon now and again, some of the weapons are crap rarity, look, bit of money, what a load of rubbish for 5 iridium. Um, so you'll sometimes get uh, certain weapons, um, you're very lucky to get purple, a lot of the time you'll get, you know, blues and things like that uh, again if you're lucky but this will actually change all of that um, so we're going to execute the mod right now uh, and then I'll show you guys quickly first where to uh, actually get it so as always you can click on the link in the description which will take you straight there or you can head over to the Borderlands 2 community github and navigate there yourself by clicking on Borderlands 2 mods and then scrolling right down to Empire Scum section which is uh, located just here <laughs> So we're going to click on that, and uh, he uh, actually provides a notes list that shows you uh, exactly what all of his mods do, rather than putting them in the actual file. But so uh, we're going to click on the uh, stallion right here. There's the code to uh, actually execute this. Uh, don't do what I've just done there. You need to click on the raw tab first uh, before right-click and save it as to your Borderlands 2 binaries folder. And then, like you saw, I've just activated that in-game. Now, uh, you quit out and come back in after executing the patch, uh, and hopefully, uh, if all goes right, improved drops will come from Butt Stallion now. Uh, and basically, uh, I've tested this for a full 500 iridium. Uh, you're going to get purples and blues all day long, uh, which is pretty good, really. Um, it's definitely a massive improvement on the uh, health files and. Um, money drops that you used to get uh, and it's just a bit of fun really uh, now obviously uh, like I said you're gonna get blues and purples uh, you want legendaries really and uh, maybe a really good um, chance of a pearl uh, obviously don't want it to be too high but uh, hopefully Empire Scum will see this and maybe if it's possible uh, be able to uh, actually improve uh, the drop rates yes I am looking up her ass right now I'm trying to work out where these guns are coming from uh, obviously well it's obvious where they're coming from but uh, damn this girl has got a lot of guns in her ass uh, but yeah anyway I'm going to skip forward as you can see we've used 40 iridium I'm going to use the whole 500 right now boom just like that there you go and that will, this is what 500 well 455 iridium will get you so uh, I'll carry on right until the end uh, and you can see uh, exactly what we're going to get but like I said it's all blues and purples uh, the funny thing is as well uh, two or three guns that came out of her in these 500 drops just absolutely flew out of her ass it was so funny I actually had to go and have a look at a couple of points I'm pretty sure they actually flew off the cliff behind me um, so yeah uh, powerful ass but stallion has uh, definitely uh, but like I said uh, this will change uh, the game to actually just give you blues and purples from but stallion uh, hopefully Empire Scum can do something maybe up the drop rates uh, for legendaries, nothing too OP, you know, maybe a legendary or two in 500 Iridium would be awesome and, you know, a stupidly, stupidly rare chance of a pearl would be good as well. Just give uh, you a bit of fun. I know there's not a lot of uh, point to actually just come in to Butt Stallion, but if you're in that point in the game in the Tiny Tina DLC where you haven't got a lot of legendaries, but you've got quite a lot of spare Iridium because you've spent all your Iridium on upgrades and you've just got a load more, uh, and you just want fancy getting some decent purple weapons, this is a brilliant mod to actually just help you out with that and get you uh, through more of the uh, DLC with uh, a few more powerful weapons really. But uh, yeah, definitely a good idea, uh, a bit like the Teddy's Legendary Vendor um, that Empire Scum did which we've already reviewed. It's nice to just lock little parts of the game down and actually just give you something to do with them because uh, there's no 
possible other reason to come to Butt Stallion anymore at Endgame. But uh, with this mod, you actually can. So, uh, yeah, really like that idea. Like I said, hopefully the drop rates can be upped for legendaries slightly just to give you something, you know, an end goal to farm for. But, uh, yeah, there you go, guys. That is the improved Butt Stallion mod. Better drops from Butt Stallion, from Empire Scum. Let me know what you think of this down in the uh, description. Uh, sorry, down in the comments below. And, uh, yeah, for now, thank you guys for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.